Hello and welcome to the life book and the sofa on which it was created last year. I want to tell you a bit about the life book because I'm really excited by it and I also want to show you how it works. It's incredibly simple, easy to use and practical and I think probably the best way is for me to demonstrate to you how you use it because it's suitable for everyone. You can use it on two levels. One is just to open it randomly and dip into it. So let's say um, you've got a problem about your work-life balance, you're working too hard. You just find work-life balance, it's all arranged alphabetically, you find work-life balance next to this gorgeous W and you read away. There's always a project or a thing to do or a light bulb moment at the end of each entry. So it takes a minute of your time and um, you'll have got something very useful out of it. And the other way to use the life book is by going to the 10 chapters at the beginning and starting off and feeling which is important to you. So let's say you have a, a problem with relaxing. Um, when you, You'll find that out. You can read a bit about relaxing. And then um, there are lots of questions to help you work out what it is that you're not relaxing about. Is it that you're not sleeping properly? Is it that um, you're, you're too worried? What is it that's stopping you relaxing? So like the internet, there are lots of links. You can go from one place to another. It will take you to entries on stress, entries on relaxing, entries on sleep. And you can just read as much or as little as you want. Again, do the projects have a go at the light bulb moments and really get something out of it. JK Rowling talked about self-improvement in her Harvard speech. I think self-improvement is absolutely vital. It's essential for all of us and the life book is a great introduction to it. So if you want to live more, laugh more, play more or earn more, buy the life book now. Good luck. Enjoy it. Bye.